Hello, everybody. It's Noli, Monster right. Cable. All right, let's see. The head monster. I like boss here. So I've got uh, several stories to tell. Got a slide. Of you. The interesting is just not going to be me doing the storytelling. I got some videos uh, to show you also. But this is about the great audio experience that the Consumer Electronics Association has really been trying to revive audio. You know, we're pretty much in a quandary these days where we have high definition video, video's getting better, screens are getting better, we got 4K by 2K uh, content and screens, uh, you know, just around the corner for video, but it seems that audio is going the other way. You know, so what happened to audio? We got uh, little white earbuds that people listen to, uh, now, how many of you have kids that listen to your high-end audio systems? Okay, so we, we got a couple. You know, but for the most part, audio Five people. for kids is little laptop speakers or in the club. Okay, so if you're in the club, you get to hear high-end audio. But that's the only exposure they really get uh, to what a real speaker system will really amplify or sound like, and that's, that's a tragedy. And if you look at what's happening with kids today, uh, you got a plus and you got a minus. First, the plus is music is very important. Okay, what we used to do, carry around CDs and a, or LPs in a case, you know, that you had a bunch of rolls of CDs, you kept it close to you, 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 know, you cleaned them, and you, know, you didn't let bad things happen to those CDs. Well, now you can all carry it around in a very, yeah, you know, high, uh, you know, 160 gig, big, uh, gigabit uh, uh, iPod. But what's the resolution? What's the output? Okay, so here's what I say. You know, you got those little white earbuds that the kids listen to constantly. And if that's your frame of reference, how do you listen? How do you hear anything? Okay, so I said this is like watching high def content on a black and white TV. So all I got is black and white TV. How do I get high resolution? And People say, you know, MP3, it sucks. You know, MP3 is bad. Well, how do you know? You never even heard it. So the first thing you have to do is be able to hear it. You have to have the transducer. So knowing that the wife doesn't like the big high-end system these days, and knowing that we got to make compromises in our audio, and knowing that the kids don't sit there and listen to a full LP anymore on high-resolution speakers, What's the alternative? Well, the alternative is headphones. And that is the new loudspeaker. That's what we discovered. So we embarked on a mission. Okay, and that mission with uh, Beats and uh, Dre, and I'll talk to you about Dre for a second, is to educate young people that there's more to life than white earbuds. That there's more to music, even MP3, than hearing it on white earbuds. That the sound really matters. And if the sound is better, you folks know this. You get a better emotional connection with the music. You get a better emotional connection with the instruments, the Steinway piano, the vocals, uh, and how that instrument is played. And the ambience in which it was recorded in. You get to hear all those things that all of us in this room really cherish, but the young kids don't get to hear it. So we set out on a mission. And we said, this mission is to educate young people that high-end audio is cool. Now we didn't say that, because if we said that, they wouldn't buy it. But we said, let's take the icon of their music. And the reason why we picked Dre, and Dre picked us, really, is because he is, a, he started a movement in the hip-hop generation. There's no other music medium, not classical, not jazz, uh, not any other class of music that influences pop culture. What does that mean? That means it influences the way you talk. It influences the way you dress. And if you don't like the way your kids talk and dress, blame it on pop music. Yeah, there you go. 